Hi everyone. Once again, my name is Fon Omoike. I'm a parenting coach, YouTuber, and a game stylist. So today I'm going to be talking about basic hair care tips. Lots of people struggle with going natural because they don't know how to take care of their hair. You see, I I wasn't confident with my hair. I because like Natasha. Okay, Natasha, yeah, she was share, you know, she shared earlier on. I was bullied as a child and you know sadly it came from my mother. She used to say that I have a big head. So, you know, she was supposed to say that I have a head full of hair. But she instead, you know, made me feel bad about myself. You know, we, we have the tendency of believing the lies that have been told to us and what people say about our hair. So uh, I know a lot of people have slept, but I would like you to show by lifting up of your hands if you ever, if somebody has ever said something mean about your hair before. I'm glad I'm not the only person, I'm glad I'm not alone. So and that was not the only you know, time I was being bullied. When I go to the salon, you hear people say, I'm supposed to charge you, you know, the price for you. Two for one, because you know it should take the whole day to make my hair. So I didn't really like it because I was like, really, is my hair that big? So, so that takes me to the number one point: love and acceptance. You know, you have to love and accept your hair because if you don't do it, nobody will do it for you. But in my own case, it took me a while because as kids, we believe what our parents say to us. And because they are our parents, we, you know, they are the first who we know. So I, I used to believe that maybe I have a big head and coupled with what people say at the salon that, oh, it will take forever to make my hair. So number one, love and acceptance. And that takes me to the next one in the video there that I'm supposed to play, but because of time, I'm not going to play it. So number two, master the act of detangling your hair, master the art of gentle detangling. People say our hair is difficult, it is, and we also believe it. But if you, you know, master the art of taking care of it, gentle detangling it, it's not that difficult. And we should learn how to take care of our hair. And you know, I, I like to encourage black parents to learn how to take care of their hair, their kids' hair, and pass it down to them so that you know they will not come grow with that mentality that your hair is hard and lots of adults like me, like you know, you will hear them say, My mama, when I was six, she could relax her in my hair because our parents feel oh it was too difficult, just go get a prayer. So let's, you know, I'm encouraging black parents to learn to to detangle, to do little home rolls and help us to pass it down to our children. And the next one is moisturize your hair with water. I remember when I was relaxed, I I didn't used to like water to touch my hair. And two days ago, in Thursday, it was raining when we were going out preparing for the program. I was going out with my hair and allowing the water to moisture my hair, the rain to moisture my hair because I don't need to put rollers to coil it and I'm like scared that the rain is going to mess it up. So that's, and that's the beauty of going natural, that water is your best friend. So the next uh, one is, is don't make styles that are too tight on your scalp because tight scalp, scalp a tight style is known to cause some form of alopecia where your hair, you, you lose your edges or you will lose some, you know, hair in the middle of your hair because the style is too tight. I know we make it so that it will last long, but in turn it's affecting our hair health. And 
That takes me to the next one, use natural products on your scalp. I have been using natural products on my girls and one of the reasons I went natural was I was tired of relaxers. I was tired of using and ever since I discovered that the things that they put to melt our hair, to straighten it to look like, you know, another person is hurting me. So I just stopped and because of that I started using natural products like shea butter, coconut oil and a lot of natural products that help my hair which is why I came up with Fons Organic. So this is just the beginning. Um, right from day one, I've been using black soap, especially on my hair. And we all use black soap. And black soap is antibacterial, antifungal, and anti-inflammatory properties. It cleans our skin very well. It exfoliates to help improve skin texture and tones treats dandruff, prevents razor bumps, you know, our men, if they cut their hair, the bumps, it, you know, black soap does that a lot, moisturizes without stripping essential oils, black soap is made with shea butter, uh, coconut oil put together, so it moisturizes the skin without stripping essential oils, and it is safe for all skin types. I've seen somebody that has skin is light, I think, um, European, she was like, black soap does wonders for me. I was like, I can't do for black people. So it's good for all skin types. So this is gonna go around. It's a black soap shampoo with essential oils that I put together. And it is working wonders for me, my kids. And it's also boosting hair growth. And fight every acne dandruff that you might be struggling with. So, with that, thank you so much for listening and thank you so much for coming. And like I said, this is going to go around and also I'm going to share my contact in case you like it and you send your review through my contact to me and that will be it. Thank you so much for listening. Alright, thank you so much.